Hey there guys, welcome to tutorial 1 where we will be looking on free integration of to WhatsApp with the help of Twilio. So in here will be this, there, the limitations are you can't use buttons, you can't use carousers that we used in bot front and you can just use text message and image message. These two things are only supported in Twilio. And if you try to add buttons, I'll be showing you how it will look like also. So let's get started. When you start Twilio and you create an account in Twilio, on first time, you might get a trial balance, currently minus this, and your account SID, and there, there'll be some get a trial phone number, etc. etc. So Twilio will be a first thing that will be integrated with our Asa chatbot for WhatsApp. So how to do that? Uh, go to all products and services. There is programmable messaging section. Click on there. Then there is settings. There you will see WhatsApp sandbox settings. So this is where you can add your own callback from where the message comes. Okay, this is their own messaging URL, but we can add our own also, like using ng rogue or something. So first and foremost thing, what you have to do is go to a bot folder, open it in some IDE, and then. You can use docker, ng rock or any kind of services you are using for deployment. So before I get started with integration part, uh, there is a note. Here you won't be able to integrate buttons in WhatsApp. So in Twilio it doesn't handle buttons like uh, you have seen in Vodafone Care or any, any other uh, chatbot on WhatsApp. So they are, they are using buttons or quick replies, but via Twilio we won't be able to use that. For that we'll be using Wati. Okay, that will be on um, next week Thursday. So now if there is any kind of buttons, we have to modify it and remove them. So I don't think there is. Yeah, so there isn't any buttons right now. Now I'll go to my credentials.yml. And then there will be one more section as Twilio, colon, and what you have to add th that are um, that are account SID. Then there will be auth token, actually Twilio number. This all things will be as a string. So the Twilio number will start with WhatsApp. Since we are using WhatsApp, so that's why colon and there go to Twilio Messenger and get this one. Get this number. There will be this number. And uh, remove the spaces which you have here. That's it. This is our what Twilio number and there is odd token. For odd token, we have to go inside console dashboard. There we have account SID and our token so just copy our token and paste it inside the string and you might not be able to see since i have blurred it privacy issues and in the account sid we have added our account sid this is this much it is we have to add in here and now we have to do rasa so first of all, I have to start my environment, Rasa environment. So contact activate Rasa Tutu. We using for this particular purpose, I'll be using 2.1.2. You can use any version. Twilio works in each and every one. If you have any kind of issues, you can ask me on Instagram. I'm also on Instagram. Uh, or you can ask me directly in comments. So now we'll move on and run our Rasa models and I'll use the core policy
so now my rasa sahib is up and running so what i'll do is i'll create one more tab and there i'll run ng rook http tab 005 and there i'll run ng rook so i have to just paste this particular url in here in our whatsapp sandbox just right here so remove the whole url write this and there will be webhooks slash twilio slash webhook you might see it right here uh, in the bottom of the video i added this particular url which will be added okay so now you have to save it then go to the whatsapp and there search for twilio sandbox ah i hope you have saved this number then only you might be able to see it so i have tested many times so i have much more order uh, much more chats than you so there's a way code for this so this is this is the way code right now join familiar roots i'll just copy and paste it here and send the message that works okay so just a full stop came in between so i have to send it again so it has been connected and now i can test it so I, if i say hi so it send me hey how are you so i'll say sad just now just right now i'm showing you that how it will look like when it's an image and the text see it loads the image and text so for the buttons let me show you how it will show here so for the buttons let's let's say if i add it right here Dash buttons. So this is how it will look like in the terminal when when any kind of message arrives here and it's right now we'll be training our rasa model again so there wasn't much uh, modification so it just modified the templates and it saved it that's it so now we'll run the same command here so it's up and running so let me see how it looks like if i say hi uh, since it's ng rock it will take time obviously so now this is see the uh, the first is title and then in the bracket it is a payload so this is how it shows the button and if you want to show button quite properly what you can do is you can uh, make it inverted comma make it this string and then there will be like slash n with option like i and also you can add some unicode that is um i had to check it for bullets let's check it for bullets so this is the sky code for bullet points i'll copy and paste it right here that it looks good like this okay and now i'll remove the buttons just modify this like close this train it again a few inches later it creates a new model and then we'll run it again simple a few moments later so it's up and running let's see and let's check how it looks like if i say hi it will take time because since it's ng rope so you have to wait patiently see it uh, added the bullet point and the response so th this is how it looks like to user when you're chatting without buttons since whatsapp has some 
privacy and some terms for using buttons templates and other other stuffs in there so that will be looked into the next video which will be coming next week then i'll explain the whole thing why um, twilia hasn't added this stuff i hope you like this video and make sure to subscribe and comment down any kind of issue you're facing or any suggestions for next videos that you might want to see so you can also follow me on instagram that is droid city zero and you will be able to see many tips and tricks on rasa on chatbots and programming stuffs so see you there bye